God saw everything that he had made and behold it was very good then did sin enter into man trying to destroy his inheritance with the lord yet the lord is loving and merciful for he did not cause them to be disgraced or ashamed or humiliated for unto adam and to his wife did the lord god make coats of skins and clothed them then did God call Noah to save unto him a remnant through which his purposes may be fulfilled although to Adam he did say curse, curse is, is the ground, ground for thy, for thy sake. sake because of Noah he did say in his heart i will I not again curse, curse the ground any more for, for man's man sake. sake so he promised while, while the earth remains, remains seed time, time and harvest and cold and heat and summer and winter and day and night shall not cease and then he called abraham the patriarch of all generations to come the lord and made him a great nation and blessed him and made him great and he made him a blessing to Abraham and all his seed and all who would bless him or his seed would be blessed and all who would curse him or his seed would be cursed so much was the lord's blessing upon abraham that all generations were blessed because abraham believed it was accounted to him for righteousness as it is written for thou blessest o lord and it shall be blessed forever yet man continues to walk in his own delusions and god continues to keep his promise to moses he promised to raise up a prophet therefore he sent us jesus christ who shed his precious blood so that we may be redeemed from the bondage of sin because by law all things are purged with blood for without the shedding of blood there is no remission because he loves us so much he does not want any of us to perish but have eternal life through jesus christ yet the same people crucified and believed him not when he arose from the dead on the third day and tried to turn his resurrection into a lie however his word is true his word is witness to all those who hear it to all those that abide by it life to those who choose to deny it death for he has given us the power to choose between what is good and what is evil so that we may choose life that we may have the blessing that we may love him that we may obey him so that we are complete in him for in the day that he comes he may find us worthy to be received unto himself into everlasting life for he has said Surely I come quickly quickly Amen even so come Lord Jesus The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all Amen.
Jesus says, Behold, I stand at the door and knock. If any man hear my voice and open the door, I will come to him and will sup with him and he with me. Welcome Jesus Christ into your life. For more information, email us at shepherdsmissioncenter at gmail.com. Visit our Facebook page and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you. Thank you.